People in Hayward woke up to a raging fire burning just feet from their homes. A row of nearby houses under construction went up in flames. KPX 5's Devin Feely live at the intersection of Toomey Terraces with the latest on what sparked this fire. Devin? Yeah, imagine for a moment what it must have been like to be asleep in one of those upstairs bedrooms when this fire broke out overnight. The homeowners say that it was a waking nightmare that they only narrowly escaped. When I opened my eyes, uh, my whole, my room was orange. It was in the narrow space between the burning buildings and the homes behind them that the firefight was waged and won. I, you know, pulled the blinds down and I saw, you know, part of the house on fire. I kind of, you know, I was like, am I dreaming? Uh, I, I hope that I am. This was the nightmarish reality that Vicky Ugaki woke up to overnight. A row of half-finished homes fully engulfed in flames. The blistering heat breaking out her bedroom window. Hungry flames threatening to consume her home. We basically just grabbed our stuff and booked it. Yeah. Like we didn't want to stay for too long. Yeah. The second I see fire, I'm just I'm just gonna sprint and run and just get out of there. The fire broke out after midnight around 1.30 a.m. The houses, which were in various stages of construction, were empty, and neighbors feared it might be arson. The fuel's very hot there. You can see you can feel the heat. But hours later, with the fire out and emotions cooling, firefighters had a different assessment. We're still finishing up our investigation, but right now it looks like a strong probability if it started by electrical. But however it started, the builder and homeowners are facing the same tall task, rebuilding from the ashes. Now, even though some of the buildings are still standing, the home at the end of the block received the least damage. The contractor says that they will likely have to tear down and start from scratch. And the homeowners say that they are being told that it could be months for repairs to be complete on their homes. In Hayward, Devin Feely, KPIX 5.